right? 21 to 30 percent? Yes, we've got some takers there. About five, six, six takers for that. 11 to 20 percent? Yes, another three. And 0 to 10 percent. Hmm, this is an above average audience now. This is good. It is good. It is in that last segment, although perhaps not exactly what you thought. Those are the main causes of death. Um, about two-thirds from the, the top two or three there. And uh, that just leaves 3% at the bottom for all other things. So out of the half a million people who die every year, it's only 16,000 who die from external causes. But it is, of course, those which dominate the newspapers and the television and the radio, and therefore people get an impression, again, that it's much higher. And indeed, if we think of great rooms, 3%, that's one in 3,000. So we'd have to put 15 great rooms together, each with 200 people in them. And the uh, probability is that only one person in all those, in all those 15 rooms, one in 3,000, will actually die from external causes in the next year. And that is uh, something that is not usually in anybody's thinking. However, we have to also look at the public policy consequences of this mismatch. And it's obviously not all just about statistics when you get to the politics and the public policy. We sadly learnt that very strongly at the Royal Society of Arts because one of our staff was killed in the terrorist outrages on 7-7.